Excuse me, I can't stop my brain from going to dirty places. I'm sorry. It feels like encouraging but comforting at the same time. This whole album has felt like a breath of fresh air. Hello, Claire Bears. It's Elsie. Welcome to my channel. If you are new and if you're returning, welcome back. Folks, this is my first NCT Dream comeback. I can still count on one hand how many NCT Dream songs I have heard and you know still learning all the members names and whatnot but I'm really hoping that this album and doing a full complete reaction to the album will help me get to know the members better as well as help me get to know just what NCT Dream's music style is like. However based on what I have seen it seems like this concept is a lot darker than maybe what NCT Dream has done in the past. But I'm excited to get into this album, so let's get to it. But before we do, please don't forget to give this video a like if you enjoy it and subscribe to my channel. For today's beverage of the day, you think that I would have a smoothie but no. I thought I had enough fruit in my freezer to make a smoothie but I did not. And I don't have time to go <laughs> to the grocery store to get some more, so that was just a big fail on my part. But I've still got a beverage of the day. I have some Roar Organic Georgia Peach flavored water, which has some, you know, electrolytes, vitamins, whatnot. I think it is a Canadian specific brand in honor of Mark Lee, of course. Hmm, it is indeed peachy, however, it tastes very stevia-ish, almost like a very fake sweetener aftertaste to it, I don't know. And I also wanted to serve some schoolboy realness to match the concept photos for this album, but I noticed again, there was almost like a very somber vibe to it, like a, a repressed vibe almost, which is interesting considering our first song of the album here is I Can't Feel Anything. Now this was messing me up because I wasn't sure <laughs> how I should react to this album and in what order because of the dream escape films since there was chapter one through chapter five however from the thumbnails and then the official audio from the nct dream account it seemed like the order of the films was not the same order as the songs so i thought oh no <laughs> what should i do so what i'm going to do and hopefully this makes sense and works out is that i'm going to react to all five of the escape films in order and then we're going to do the album in order after that and i am praying to the sm gods that this works out and that they don't block this video because for whatever reason they don't like it when you react to an entire album in one video so if i have to break this up into chunks that is why but we are starting out with chapter one in order which lines up with i can't feel anything so let's get started here with an asleep jisung Realize chapter one. Oh. <gasps> Is he in prison? Out. Oh. Walk. This feels so dystopian. Oh. Oh my goodness. Oh. Is he having visions? Swallow. Of the future. Ooh. 
Oh my goodness. Oh. This is beautiful. He's able to like escape to this world where he can dance and be free. Oh no, his poor feet. Huh. So it's like feeling of freedom. So is that the that's what the pill is doing is kind of like suppressing those feelings, you know? So when he didn't take it, he was able to feel that sense of like joy and freedom that he can experience through ballet, through dance. And the instrumental there was really nice, which I'm assuming it's for I can't feel anything. It just felt like so dreamy and really matched up well with that theme of escape. So I'm digging it so far. Let's go on to chapter two now. Confused. Shoot. So are they all in this like dystopian prison? This is Chen Lei? And that's Jano. I hope I'm getting these right. I'm still learning. Shoot. Felt like I'm about to drown. I'm not breathing. Don't do that. Don't tell me not to go. I'll go. I'm never gonna bring me down. Hmm. So are those memories or almost visions of the future? Because he kind of looked like dead behind the eyes. Oh. Ooh. So one by one, the doors opening for each of them. So maybe that's what each film is going to be, is just the doors opening for each one of them and being able to escape. And because it looks like we're, we're doubling up for two, three, and four, does that mean that the fifth one is going to be their escape where they come together? I don't know. And I wasn't, <laughs> I honestly was not paying attention to the instrumental for that one too much, which was our last song on the album, Breathing. But I really, really love this shot. It feels like black swan-esque and just like the contrast between the wings and you know his like muscles and masculinity i'm just really loving this world that's being created so far i want to know like <laughs> i want to know where they ended up why are they here how did they get here just so many questions so maybe we'll find out in chapter three which is unknown change It's very like Blade Runner. Oh, this is Mark, my fellow Canadian. Hmm. So, what if all this could just be so easy, just like? Don't just let go. Be brave. Be strong. Take it. Yeah, they're all just seeing the the light one by one. Don't what? Don't change. For a second I thought they said don't ginge. And I was like, what? What's wrong with being a ginger? <laughs> I was about to be real offended. Hmm. I'm 
excited to see them all come together. And it is interesting how despite this very like dark and dystopian vibe that we have visually, the songs don't seem that way at all. And it's more representative of like the dream world, I suppose. On to the next. Chapter four is box, which based on this here, it's like whew, boxing. So let's watch. Chapter four, break. So Jamin. Oh shoot, no, that, that's Chen Lei. And I think in the second video was Renju. Huh. So they're training. What are they training them for? Mm. More of like a hip hop vibe. And they're not gonna do it either, are they? In the next chapter they're all gonna come together aren't they i'm just so impressed with this so far and i really love the acting they're showing their versatility here but now we're finishing with chapter five dream beyond and the song was carrot cake when i saw that on <laughs> the track list and saw that it was spelled like carrot like slip as 17 fan i was like oh but i doubt that it's a 17 reference so let's get to it let's watch the final chapter Are they gonna take some bitches down? What's that thing on my wrist? What's that thing on my wrist? Mm. Never seen nothing like this. Never seen nothing like this. Ooh. So they're all tied together, literally and metaphorically. So it's Ji Sung who brought them all together. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> so they were being ranked in terms of their abilities, their talents. said reality and beyond to reality no, no, no. Oh. <gasps> oh so that was the dream not the other way around or is it dun, dun, dun. Oh my goodness. 
call back to the first scene. Oh my goodness. Wow, this was so interesting. I love, love, love when groups will have lore and stories behind each album. So this very much excites me and I don't know if this is kind of like lore contained within the album or if this is continuing on the NCT Dream Universe lore more broadly. Either way, I'm in. I'm all in. <laughs> and I love this like inception-ness of it, of wondering, you know, what was real and what was not. Like that cup at the end falling over reminded me of the final scene from Inception when the top is just spinning and spinning and you you don't see whether or not it stops. So I just love how many like different movies this evoked and how many different things it made me think of. It had that just cinematic element to it that felt like a movie, like a proper movie. 